Hello, fellow employee, and welcome to your first day on the job. My name is Irrelevant, and I'll be providing you with information on your current objective. Your goal is to go to various abandoned moons and try to collect any and all valuable materials that you may find, such as iron, lead, aluminum, silver, calcium, and sodium, for the company to then recycle and repurpose all that useless junk into stuff people actually care about, like Blu-ray DVDs, atomic weapons for war, or even cheese graters. Huh. Cheese graters. You and your crew will have three whole days to collect enough junk in order to meet the quota set by the company. And remember that failure to reach the quota in the given time period will result in immediate termination from the company. Good luck! The company is not responsible for physical harm, psychological harm, illness, or any of the things stated under C9 of your contract. Additionally, you will not receive any of the working benefits stipulated to you until you have experienced everything under the section C9 of your contract. Wait, so we're not getting free food? Nah, dude, this job's a total sham. Oh, man. Yo, Yellow, what's the quota? Um... About $350. We can make that in, like, what, two days? As long as we're not stupid. Alright, so our options for moons are... Um... Um... Experiment. Sweet. Any questions? Are there monsters down there? Yes. Is there any way I can defend myself? Yes. Am I gonna die? Yes. Do you like men? Yes. Ah, uh, I'm just gonna hit the lever. Sure, we shouldn't go with the others. I mean, they're safety in numbers after all. I mean, you have me, so I don't know why you're complaining, but if you really want to be that way, then hey man, ladies first. Uh, all right. I'm not going back in there, dude. What? Come on, dude, it can't be that bad. Ten bucks is they're both dead. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, okay, okay. Dude, come on, we need to go. You have a lot of stuff. Awesome. Well, sh we only got like a hundred dollars from that. Yeah, to be honest, we could have a lot more if I was able to see where I was jumping. Was that directed at me? Or okay. That's enough, I think. Let's get out of here. I think it is this way. We're definitely lost. Oh, hey guys, look, I found a fire exit. Wait, really? Yeah, it's just over here. You gotta. I think I just speed a little. My bad, guys. Oh god, you lost everything. Personally, I blame him. If he just hadn't walked on that goddamn landmine. What do you mean? It's his fault. If he didn't go for the beehive and just went back to the ship, we would still have our money. This is all on him. Oh, are you kidding me? I was just compensating for him making us lose so much last time. It's not my Dude, fault. I can get There's literally no one else Stuff like this. Right, 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 right. 
All right, guys, we have to focus up here. If we want to meet Dakota, we have to get everything we possibly can. Us three will take the main entrance. You go to the fire exit. Wait, where, where's the fire exit on um, this moon? I, I have no idea. Guys. Guys. Okay, how much do we get? Um, I got about $79 worth of stuff right now. I'm worth about 91. And I'm 98. So all of us combined would probably be somewhere around $260. All right, that's pretty good. Um, any of you seen the other guy? Never mind. You're alive? Yeah. So, did you get anything? Oh, yeah, um, I got this painting, um, an old cash register, and this, uh, bar of gold. Honestly, I think bringing it all back made me break my spine. Wait, when did you get back to the ship? Oh, like, 12 a.m. I mean, I couldn't go any further because everything was locked, so I just kind of came back here. You found that all in one room. W wait but I heard gunshots earlier. If that wasn't you, then what was it? Uh... Uh... I don't know, it must have been the wind, I guess.